What's up everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix. You might be getting this particular message which says, your password must be at least 8 characters long and include a number and an uppercase letter and a lowercase letter. So you might be getting this error when you're trying to change your password. So how we can completely fix this error. So it's not a big deal. So let me directly get into the step. So the first one is all about in order to fix that, we need to set the password based upon what the Apple is stating right now. So you should be having an uppercase as well as a lowercase and a numeric or a special character. So what I'm going to do is let me type a password here. So for the instant, I'm going to type the channel name of uh, my channel name. I'm going to give it as a password here. So what it's going to do is I'm going to type the first letter should be a small letter. That should be, it means it should be a small letter, whatever the letter it can be. For the instant of the time being, I'm going to give my channel name. So I'm going to type the first letter as a small one that is I. I have given I. Now I need to give a capital letter. So my channel name is I Rabbit. So I have to give the second name that second letter should be R. So I'm going to give it capital letter that is R. Okay. Now I need to type rest one that is A B I T. So over here right now I have given a small letter as well as a uh, big letter. I have given this uh, small letter as well as the uppercase and the lowercase has given. And right now I need to give a numeric value. So I'm going to give a value over here. I'm going to give another one number. I'm going to type the number that is random number six nine. Okay. Now we need to type it once again. We need to type the password once again. First thing you need to notice, you should be giving a small letter that is I. Then I, I need to type a capital letter that is R. Now I need to type rest over here like this. Now I need to give a numeric one that is six, nine. So I have given this and the only the thing that you should be keeping aware while changing the password one letter in the password should be a small, small one. I mean, the smaller case and another one should be an uppercase and a numeric value should be there. And also make sure it should be eight characters long. If it is less than eight characters, we'll be having the trouble. So right now it is nine character. So it is fine, which means all the requirement of the Apple, which is requested. So now I need to go for continue. So right now, as you can see, the password will be changed and without any issue, the password is completely changed. This is what you have to do. And I hope this video is helpful. And if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. See you soon on the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.